Hey, did you pay all your bills last month? Oh, yeah, sure, most of them. Hey, Skinny, what did I tell you about biting your nails? A few little odds and ends, but I'll get the money for that. Uh-huh, that's what Boy's I said. Boy's Town, the 1938 movie, tells the true story of a priest devoted to helping troubled boys. You might as well save your breath. I ain't talking. It was a bad day when I brought you here. I've always said there was no such thing in the world as a bad boy. I've built my life on it. You're the only boy in all these years that hasn't had a heart somewhere that I could reach somehow, sometime. Spencer Tracy reached many hearts with his moving portrayal of Father Flanagan. Mickey Rooney plays Whitey Marsh, the rough, tough kid the priest finally manages to soften. When Mickey Rooney made Boys Town in 1938, he was 17 years old, and he was the number one box office star in the world, ahead of Gable and everybody else. Of course, between then and now, he was on hard times. As he said at the Academy Awards, when he was 40, he couldn't even find a job. Happily, things are better for him now. He's starring in Sugar Bays, which has left Broadway now touring the country. And of course, along the way, he had eight marriages. So when I was recently backstage with the Mick, I asked him about eight trips to the altar. Everybody's had a lot of wives. Oh, okay. Lovable Cary Grant's had five. Yeah. Huh? You've had eight. Yeah, but five for Cary. Five. That's know. not two. I thought he had two. No, five. Well, there's three we don't know five. about. Five. Oh, yeah. That's all right for Carrie, see? See, then, then you're just uh, emotionally unstable Mickey with eight. But five for Carrie is... Five. Artie Shaw had... Whatever. And I feel sorry for these people because every divorce is a five-car crash. But the fact is, getting back to Carrie Grant, uh, uh, he's the most wonderful man in the world. And these, you can find people in Florida who've been married eight times. Of course. But their names weren't Cary Grant or Mickey Rooney. You're sensitive then about that, aren't you? No, I'm not. I'm not, because my linen is always out. Oh, my bedroom is completely open. But I paid for it. It's nobody else's money. I paid for it with my broken hearts. Yeah. It's nobody else's broken hearts. It's mine. Is it tough for your children? How many do you have? I have ten. Is it tough for them being children of Mickey Rooney? The, no, the I would have thought it would be, but they came to me. I left them alone during their embryonic years. Uh, their mothers uh, brought them up. Uh, my progeny, I'm so very proud of. I named uh, one of a wonderful man named Mickey Rooney Jr. My God, what a mistake I'd made. Really? Frank Sinatra Jr. Oh, God, it's got to be tough. Mm. There was only one junior that made it, do you know? Douglas Fairbanks Jr. Oh, yeah. uh, all the other juniors, Desi Arnaz Jr., you know, I don't know what kind of a, an idiot I w was. I know I'm an eighth smart. I have an eighth of an intelligence. And uh, why well, I ever named him Mickey Rooney Jr., I begged him to change his name. He said, Dad, my name is Mickey Rooney Jr. And I had to love him for it. Forget Mickey Rooney the actor. What kind of a person? What's your real name? It's not Mickey. It's, my, it's Joe. Joe Rooney. Yeah, it's just, no, it isn't Joe Rooney. Oh. It's Joe Ewell. You're wrong, sir. I didn't know that. Well, now you do. I forgot. I know. Well, you have to be corrected sometimes when you're wrong. Y-U-L-E. Yeah, Y-U-L-E, right. Uh, Who gave you the name Mickey Rooney? Uh, a fella at Universal. When I was 11 years old, I'd been Mickey McGuire. I come to various names. Baldy, Shorty, Hey You. I come to various names, but uh, Rooney's uh, lasted anyway. Uh, forgive this personal question; it's not really personal. But has it bothered you being? Well, is, there any, is there any? Is there anything that hasn't been printed about me? I don't know. I don't but care I'm here with you about... face to face. It's different to talk no, to a man. No, it isn't. Okay. No, it Does doesn't it bother, bother you me. Being small man. No, I'm not a small man. Okay. I can outrun you. I can beat you playing golf. I can beat you playing tennis. I mean, I can. Uh, being small has nothing to do with the book. Yeah. The cover. I know plenty of tall guys who can't get out of their own way. You, you, I would say that, how old are you today? 62. I, I would, okay. 63 in September. I would say 63. Your life's turning out pretty nice, pretty good, wouldn't Incidentally, you? Incidentally, it's, it's just fantastic. I'm happily married to yeah. a gal called Jan, and who's seated over there, who's a, a great gal. We fight all the time, but that's good. It keeps my circulation. Is that true, going. Jan? You fight? Sure. Uh, very true. Very true. Sure. <laughs> but I love him. Sure. I wouldn't right. fight with anybody else. Yeah, what the hell? <laughs>
But, okay, but I'm coming to a point, I hope. Go ahead. <laughs> Did you think 25 years ago, when, whenever you think your life was at the bottom, or when the public thinks oh, when it was? when I knew it was. Did you know it was going to end up as good as it's ended up? Or oh, did you God, think, no. oh, my God. Don't you know what is attributed to all of the things and the fuss and the flora and fauna that the forest has regrown? Yeah. Don't you know what uh, is attributed to that? No. My Lord Jesus Christ. I'm a, I'm a, a reborn Christian. I know where Mickey Rooney is, and uh, I know where Mickey Rooney's going. I, I'm, I know that if I were to die tonight, I'd be with my Lord Jesus Christ, and I'm not, uh, uh, I'm not a, I'm not afraid. I'm, I'm very proud to know that I've been down and up, because let me tell you something. It takes a lot of people to make somebody somebody, Joe. No one person can do it alone. And somebody asked me one time, he said, Mickey, uh, when you pass on, what do you want on your epitaph? And I said two words. I tried.